Hello again, everybody. Madman here. And this was just finished. We gotta do this quick because I'm running out of time. I gotta go to work. Um, I have another Legends of the Hidden Temple level here from Little Big Planet. This one was uh, requested by Boy Every Day 25, I believe. Yeah, Boy Every Day is 25. Uh, this will probably be the last one for a little bit and at the end of the video I'll give you an idea on what I want to do for the next one. It will probably be the last one though for this before I do some other things. May I might come back to this some hope. But let's look at this really quick. We have the lost treasure. Uh, the tre We're going to learn to talk eventually today. I'm going to rush. Sorry. It's the lost treasure map to Toy ben Toy Banya. The Lost Treasure back to Topanga. Um, what was he? I guess he got the idea for this from uh, some old TV show called um, Danger Island. Um, if you look at that picture real quick, it is actually the same as this one because I couldn't find a different version of a map. <laughs> and let's be honest, half the props that were probably on Legends of Hidden Temple, especially the maps were reused more than once. We are going to dive in. It looks like two people have already play as are already playing it. Thank you for playing that, whoever you two are. But we're gonna play this on our own. Oi! Hurt my back. <laughs> I probably hear my TV in the living room. Legends of the Hidden Temple. And it's still open. I might. I'm blah, 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 blah. I told you, I'm gonna learn to talk someday. Um, it's still open. Um, if you have a PlayStation, a PS4, um, and you have Minecraft, um, if you want to attempt uh, Olmex Temple in that, uh, give me a shout out. I can load it up, invite you, and. We can do an episode of that. You either get to run through the temple, or you can be a temple guard. But until then, hello, welcome to my temple. I am Olmec. There are many treasures lost within my temple, and today you'll be in search of the treasure map to the lost city of Topanga, Tabanya, uh, which can be found in the room of the fallen columns. That's a that room has not made an appearance yet in this version. Uh, if you should know of the rooms of the temple, grab the Pendant of Life. Ready, dude? Grab it. You can start by running up the stairs to the room with three gargoyles. Press the correct tongue. And you can swing across the pit. Here, you can choose your next path. You could choose to go up to the observatory, spin the celestial lights, and you could choose to head down into the room of the fallen columns, where you can grab the lost map to the lost city of Tabanya. From here, you can pass through to the room of the golden idols, push down their bases to release the doors, which may take you below, or lead you into the shrine of the silver monkey. Assemble a statue, and you may be able to enter the room in a secret password. Find a tablet with the correct inscription and shout it out to open the door to the dungeon. From here, plow through the stone wall into the dark forest. Reach into the hole and find the key, but be careful. One of the trees could be inhabited by the spirit of a temple guard. Find the key in the tree and enter the justice court. Press yourself against the correct wall painting and you can enter the room of harmonic convergence. Stand on the proper step and if the correct door unlocks. Then you can crawl back through the pit of despair. <laughs> then climb through the ledges. Race down the stairs and back through the temple gates. The choices are yours and yours alone. Good luck. I love how Sackboy actually holds on to the pendant the entire time during that video. I will now lower my gate. You have three minutes. Good luck. I wish I was smart enough to know how to program stuff in this game so you make him do like a 
sound that made him sound like he was forcing out a, a horrible crap or something. I woke up with heartburn or something. But we're going to the temple. We are going to go to the room of fallen columns. We are going to get the map. We're going to get the hell out. We're going to go to space camp. And then we're going to work because I'm probably going to run late today. <laughs> I don't care. On your mark. Get set. Go! And there goes Sekwa. He's off into the temple. He's in search of that lost treasure map. It's in the center of the temple in the, in the room of the fall column. You guys are Oh, that opened immediately, but there's a temple guard hiding in the gar room of three gargoyles. The temple guard takes his pen and he's gonna go. He's going to jump and swing across. Using those vines. Beautifully. No, neither room will open. Ooh, so he's gonna go down into the room of the harmonica virgins. And, oh, another tumble guard. That was quick. So quick, but his partner, aka him, is gonna go back in himself. Let's go, you little Ned Flanders wannabe. He's into the room of three. Tempted to go into the room of three girls. Why aren't you going in? There we go, you little idiot. He's going down. He's going to jump into the pit. He's going to swing. That was that. Ooh, I heard one of the uh, pellets break. <laughs> I don't care. He's into the room of the, uh, the room of modern conversions. That one works. Who's going to go up? He's going up. He's going up. No, he can't go up. Oh, he's into the Jester's Court now. He's got to press himself against the correct wall painting. And when he does that, the room will light up with that eerie green glow. And it does. He is into the dark forest. He's got to find the key in the tree. Only oh, does. First one. He's gonna go up. He's gonna go up. No, he's not gonna be able to. So he's gonna go into the dungeon. He's gonna do this. Oh, he's gonna go for a smart pass. Oh, and that's open too. He is into the. He opened the wrong one. Shit. He is in the, uh, the Shrine of the Silver Monkey. He's got 60 seconds. He's got one minute. He's got the bottom. He's got the middle. He's just jammed the head down. When he gets that head down, it'll be one room away, it looks like. He's in there. He's got all oh, Temple Guard! A little bitch slap for Temple Guard. Oh, he's, oh he opens it! Oh, he's gonna go up. No, he's gonna go right into the room. He's gotta work his way to it. And I forgot the trigger to make it disappear, but he's got it nonetheless. Oh, he's got 24 seconds. Oh, can he do it? Can he get out? Don't know why he grabbed that. He's coming down the stairs. He's jumping down the stairs. He's got it. He's going to space camp. fix this, right? Yes, I did. Alright. So, as you can see, we had, uh, two new rooms that I've, well, technically three, I guess, that we have not done yet. Uh, the first was the, uh, the pit with the vines. The second was the, uh, room of the fallen columns where I messed up. I forgot to trigger the uh, the object that disappear after he grabs it, but everything still worked off without a hitch. Still look amazing, there, perfect. And I like this. This is the the room of the uh, uh, golden idols. I have a device set up up in the air that once you grab the golden idol, it will trigger a piston that's inside that's hidden underneath the golden idol to retract and that brings it down to its base and I thought it was a good idea so it's something that has not been done yet that this room was never completed on a show as far as I remember I think only one kid actually attempted the room and I think that was a uh, what was the episode uh, John Sutter's uh, map to the lost gold mine monkey Um, we 
got the, uh, oops, <laughs> I'll fix that later, because that went down, I don't know why, it was supposed to stay up, I'll fix that later, um, but before I go, this is obviously, like I said, it's a short video, I gotta go to work, I actually got like, a couple minutes before I have to leave, let's go, I don't know why I'm going up here, why the hell am I going up here? Oh. Just so I can do that. Alright, so we're going to go back to Olmec. Whee! Huh. I came in like a wrecking... Hey, he's got the construction hat too. <laughs> oh yeah. Each one makes a different shriek. I like that. So now we're back here. Here's our map. Sackboy's got another trip to uh, Space Camp because of that. So now we're back here for the Olmec. I figure I'll tell you guys this. I'm thinking of doing another one of these. Um, I'm going to have to delete a level because I'm at the max that the uh, server allows you to hold of 20. So a level will probably be deleted. It'll probably be like one of the first ones I did. Maybe I th maybe most likely Father Time's Hourglass. Um, with that being said, the next one I do, it'll probably be the last one for a little while. And wake up, dude. And with that one, oh, excuse me. With that one, I want you guys to come up with rooms that you want like i'm not talking about like oh yeah can you put in the dungeon or the well or king storeroom or the shrine of silver Mine. that's gonna be there no matter what i mean like a room you came up with tell me what like i'll come up with the object for this one i, I got one in mind i've been wanting to do i want you guys to come up with room ideas you can keep the cave, the ledges, as is. You can come up, uh, like, the ice cave, and I can put it all blue. Room of the Three Gargoyles of... Uh, what was it? There was a guy a couple years ago, Mr. Bino or something like that. Diano, I don't remember the name exactly. You probably, a couple of you might remember him. He wanted to make this for the Wii. He wanted to make Legends of the Hidden Temple for the Wii, and he came up with a whole bunch of different rooms. Like, what was one? Like, one of the ones I liked was, like, the center of the temple, the heart room area, was a giant mirror, and the room was called the Mirror Interior. And the thing about that room was that there were uh, panels of the mirror that were protruding out of the walls, and you had to push them back in, and one of them would open the doors, or... What was another one? The uh, the Jester's Court area was the t uh, the Tomb of the Unnamed Maiden or something like that. And you had these um, grave markers. It said, here lies, but there was no name. And you had to f grab the nameplate and put it in front of the grave marker. And the correct one would open the doors. I like, I like stuff like that. Obviously, those were his ideas. I'd rather not use his, no offense to him, but if you guys got a room idea that you want, that you've, like, oh, well, why didn't I put this one in the temple? Like, I had one when I was a kid playing uh, with a version I made, like, with my little professional wrestling action figures. I made a room, I don't remember what I call it, but it was, like, like the generator room or something like that, where... You had like a power switches, and you had you had to find three levers, like those really ancient like ones you'd see in like the Dracula or Frankenstein movies. You had to pull those down, and those would activate like the generator, which would open the room or something. But that's what I want you guys to do. That'll probably be my last one for a while. If you want to participate in Legends of the Hidden Temple on Minecraft, I have that. I have Double Dare. And I have Nickelodeon Guts. I just finished that a couple days ago. And I might show that off later on. Hopefully we might do a pilot with a couple friends over the weekend. I'm praying. I don't know. Maybe we'll do some uh, 
We'll do some um, Fall Guys in the future. Uh, maybe some NHL. I don't know. Probably some professional wrestling. I would love to do that again. Because I had something like that I was going to start up years ago and I couldn't get my feet off the ground with it. I would love to restart that. But let me know, wait, let me know what you want to do for the rooms for probably the last one for a while of Legends of the Hidden Temple on Little Big Planet. Sackboy, wave goodbye. Don't let Olmec eat you. And we will see you guys all next time. I'll say that Kirk Fox this time. We will see you all next time for another great legend. Say it, Sackboy. Of the Hidden Temple! Later, guys. I'm going to work. Goodbye.